Hey guys, it's Dave for Gamers on Games. Uh, this is just a real quick pickup video. Uh, I just found out that uh, Rick Loomis of uh, Flying Buffalo has passed away. Um, if you guys are unfamiliar, he is really old school. Um, he's like Gen 1 uh, for the gaming industry. Um, I had a connection with uh, Rick for a while, actually. Um, we fell out of touch a couple years ago. But he and I kind of got to know each other when he used to attend um, Dexcon back when I was vending for um, Art House Orion. So that'd be back in the East Brunswick days. And um, we, uh, I mean, we hit it off. He and I would talk and we talked about, because um, he sold these battle books. And we were talking about the ones um, that he was selling, especially the ones um, based on the anime uh, Queen's Blade. And... We talked about nuclear warfare, um, the game, and, um, well, we talked about the real thing, too. Um, but the guy was just a wealth of knowledge, very personable, very cool. I'm, I'm kind of regretting that I fell out of touch with him, um, but nothing to be done about it now. Um, he had cancer, and uh, I know there was a GoFundMe, um, to raise money for the bills that were accrued during the cancer treatment. But unfortunately he has, he has passed on. Um, I will keep you guys posted on any like charities or anything else that comes out of this. Um, I literally just found out and, uh, I wanted to, um, you know, let you guys know and, uh, express my, my, my regrets, uh, to his family and condolences. And, um, yeah, this is, it's a real loss. Um, I guess there's not much else to say. So, um, I hope, uh, his family is okay. Um, I know he's got kids and grandkids and, um, I'm hoping that they can, they can take this well. Um, because there's unfortunately nothing else that I can wish for them at this point. But, uh, I'll keep you guys posted. And uh, we'll see you guys next time. Dave out.